Shall we start? Okay. How are you today? You're fine. And you? Okay. Not so bad. A bit tired. A bit tired. You can say tired. Yes, a bit tired. I say tired. Tired? Tired. Tired. You're good. Tired. Tired. Yes, that's how you say it. And if you want to say biraz, a bit. A bit tired. Okay, I see a bit tired. I see. In the previous lesson, let's remember. What did we learn? What are you doing? Yes, what is she doing? What is he doing? You remember that? Yes, like in this picture, what is she doing? What is she doing here? She's eating. Eating something. She is eating, okay? So she's eating hamburger. Okay, next picture. What are they doing? They are. They are. They are eating out. Eating out in a restaurant. You can just say they're eating out. It's enough. Uh huh. Next picture, Emir. What are they doing? He's listening to music. He's listening to music. What are you doing right now? I'm sitting. Okay. I'm sitting down. Okay. So the question is what are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, the answer is I'm sitting down. How do you pronounce this? The contraction here. How do you say this? She's. She's. She's eating. This one? They're eating. This one? He's listening to music. And this one? I'm sitting. Okay. So that was present continuous tense. Talking about now. Yes, you remember the time expressions? Now, what's another one? At the moment. Yes. At the moment. And one more. We have at present. At present, at the moment, now. All of them mean the same. Şimdi. Okay? Good. Now, we are going to start a new unit. Please look at page 54. Page 54. Next page. Yes. What's the name of the chapter? Huh? Under? Okay. Working under Undercover. What does this mean, undercover? Do you know? No, think about if you do something undercover, you do it secretly. Nobody knows about it. Top secret. Undercover. You do it something secretly. Okay? Doing secretly. Nobody knows. It's secret. Yes? No? Um, think about the police, okay? Think about the police. If they don't have a uniform, they come here, they sit down. We don't know because this man is undercover. He's a police, but we don't know because he doesn't have a uniform. He doesn't have a gun. Yes? So if you say undercover, it is what? Secret. So, what do you think it is? Gizli, yes. Huh? Gizli, undercover. Undercover. 
means gizli. Gizli çalışan. Yes, gizli, undercover. Ya da şey, ne? Kendini bir şekilde kamufle etmiş olan, undercover. Cover means kapak, örtü. So undercover, kendini gizlemiş yani. Gizli. Secret bu arada means gizli. Okay? So undercover means secret. Okay? So this unit, look, is undercover boss. What does the word boss mean? Boss. Boss? No, big is big. Boss? Yes. So undercover boss. Undercover boss. <laughs> okay, yes. Undercover boss. This is a name of um, the name of a TV program in the UK, England. It's a TV show. Undercover boss. Did you know that? It's a TV show. Can you turn on the um, air conditioning? It's a television program. Remember like Big Brother. Yes? Undercover Boss is a television program. Okay? In England. So what happens in this program? Do you know? What happens? What happens in this program? They want about problems. They want to find out about problems, but who does what? Who joins this program? Who joins this program? Yes. I'll give you a minute. Let's read this part together, shall we? Look. Undercover Boss. Undercover Boss is a TV show. It's a TV show where different bosses work undercover. They want to know more about their, their workers and about problems in their companies. In episode one, David Clark, the boss of a big hotel chain, is working undercover for a week in one of his hotels. So what happens here? You know the word boss, undercover boss. So what does he do in this TV show? You can tell me in Turkish. Tell me in Turkish, what happens? What happens in this show? Ne oluyor ki bu? Ne hakkında? What is it about? What's going on? They want to know more about their work. Who wants to know? <gülüyor> Bosses. Çin büyük bir Çin oteli. Not Çin, chain. Chain. Chain. If you are, if you have a hotel chain, you have many brands. Not brands, branches, actually. So tell me, what's the name of the boss? What's his name? The, you talked about it. Look, it says, David Clark, the boss of a big hotel chain, yeah, so his name is what? David. David. Okay. And he works for? He's the boss of a big hotel chain. They have many branches. Okay. Can you think of a hotel uh, um, with lots of different branches? I think Hilton has lots of different branches. It's a hotel chain. Or Swiss Hotel. They have lots of different branches in many different places all over the world, yes? 
Okay, so why is he undercover? Why? Why is he undercover? Look. Um, they. Uh huh. Know more about their workings. And about problems in their companies. So they want to know why? Because he wants to know. He wants to know what? He wants to know the problems. What are the problems? Yes? He wants to know the problems in his workplace. And he wants to know the what? The, company. the other workers. Yes, he wants to know the workers. He wants to know the problems. Okay. Now, over there, you will see some information about his everyday life. Every day and today. Okay? Every day and today. So, let's think about David's everyday life. Huh. He usually works. Okay. He usually works in an office. But today, but today, he is working. Okay, let's do this. He is working in a hotel. Okay, one more. He usually wears a suit. He usually wears. He usually, oops, sorry, I was gonna do this. He usually wears a suit. Yes, but today? But today he's blue jeans and t shirt. He's wearing blue jeans and a t shirt. Okay, blue jeans and t shirt. And? He usually has important. What does important mean? Hmm? What does it mean? Important? If something is important, you are very careful about it because it's you are careful and you want it to work well. You are, it's very important. Önemli. Important. I'm going to write down the words here. Important. Okay? Önemli. Okay? But today, what is he doing today? He usually has meetings. He is? Working. He's working? In the bedrooms. Okay. Is it finished? One more. Uh, he usually. He usually. Yeah, finishes work at. He usually finishes. At six. Okay. Uh, but. At six p.m. But. Today he working at nine. Today he is working. Eight. Until? Eight. Eight. Eight. Eight p.m. Okay, cool. Now, look carefully. This is about David. Huh, Abdullah? David. This is about David's everyday life. Okay? I'm sorry, we have to do this. This is about David's everyday life and today. If it's every day, it's something regular, huh? all the time. Usually, it is the same. So it repeats itself. Yes? 
So he works. He wears. He has, but he finishes. Here, today, it means now. Now. Okay? Yes, bugün, şimdi, şu anda. He's working. Look. He is working. He is his wearing. He's working. He's working again. Okay? So if you're talking about now, we form the sentences with what tense is this? Present continuous. Şimdiki zaman, değil mi? Present continuous. In Turkish, iyor. Çalışıyor. Uh, what giyiyor? But here, every day, what is it? Present simple. Evet, present simple. In Turkish? Not getmiş. Geniş. Her zaman, every day. So, present simple. Giderim, kalkarım, giyerim, toplantı yaparım. Every day. Okay? So that's about it. In this unit, we are comparing every day, today. How is it like? Now think about yourself. Think about your everyday life and think about today. You didn't wake up early, okay? So you were sleeping. You usually wake up early, but today it was different. Okay, that's good. And uh, what time do you finish school? Uh, school. I, I, I usually, I usually finish school, school at, four. at four, but today, Finishing it. I'm finishing it. Uh huh. At three. Okay. I usually wear. I usually wear jeans, but today I'm not wearing jeans. For example. Yes. What about you, Abdullah? Give us one example. I usually finish. Mm hmm. Work. Okay. At, uh, nine, nine, uh, okay. Uh, I am finishing uh, it at uh, seven. Today. Uh, oh, but it's the same? At nine or seven? Uh, seven. Seven. Okay. Have you done this? Yes? Okay, let's do it together. Um, Sue says, hi Sue, where are you? In the office? No. I'm working at home today. Okay. Uh, next. Are you doing? Are you doing your homework? I am playing a computer game, okay? Marisa is a nurse. She works in a hospital. Okay, next one. We are on holiday in France. Yes. We are staying in a nice little hotel. We are staying, yes. Hi, can you talk or are you... Are you driving? Can you talk or are you driving? At the moment, now. Dima. Okay. Next one. I don't or I'm not. 
I am I am not driving but I can talk. Araba sürmüyorum ama konuşabilirim. I can talk. Okay? I Okay, okay, I'm talking to my boss. Seninle konuşamam, I'm talking to my boss. Patronumla konuşuyorum. Okay, next one. Let's go to Mexico in December. It's never evet, it never rains. I usually have a big lunch, but today I'm having a small salad. So, today and every day. I want you to look at this. We have Jess. This one. This is my Jess. With a big smile. Okay? This is Jess. So, and I have written down some things about Jess's everyday life. She does it every day, regular activity. Okay? But today, today it is a different day. She's not doing the same things because it's a different day. Today, she's going camping. Huh? Not at home. She's not at home. So today, she is camping. Okay? I want you to think about her everyday life and today. How is it different? How is it different? For example, um, Jess, think about everyday. Jess, she she sleeps, she sleeps in her in her room in her bed okay but today is she at home she's, she's not at home where is she, she today she is she's in the forest forest or man Forest. She's in the forest. She's camping. Okay? So, she is sleeping in a... What? If, yes, in a tent. Tent is this. Yes. That's a tent. <laughs> okay? It's a tent. So, today she is sleeping in a tent. Okay? What about now? This uh, today, sorry, every day. Think about breakfast. Every day she she eats, she eats every day she eats a big breakfast at home with her family. But today, today is a different day. Today she is eating Yes, cereals with a spoon. So she's eating, she's eating cereals alone. Uh, yes, alone, yamnas, with no other people. Think about every day, every day. She, she wears. Wearing. She wears gimmick. So she wears smart clothes. She wears smart clothes. But today she's wearing jeans. Okay. Now, sports shoes. Not sports shoes, sorry, high heels. High heels? High heels. Yes, <laughs> high heels. So, she wears high heels, but today she's camping, so she can't wear high heels. She is? She's wearing boots. Okay? Done? I want you to remember this. Do you want to take a photo? Good.
Okay? Ready? I want you to think about this. Um, okay? Now think about your everyday life, okay? Diyelim ki bugün bayram. It's a bayram day, bayram morning, okay? Bugün. Think about every day and today. Today is bayram, but every day you go to work, yes? Every day go to work. Do you go to work in on Byron day? No. So no work. How do you make a sentence? I I I goes. No. He goes. I I go to work every day. But today it is Byron. I'm not, I'm not going to work. Okay? I'm not going to work. Yes? You wear smart clothes or let's say um, mm, okay this one Mm, this one. Don't you don't, right? I want you to come up with full sentences about Byron. Okay? Another one. Uh, let's see. Hall means tomb. Can you write down sentences about your day today, Bayram? Think about your every day. Hmm? You can write them down somewhere there. Her gün nasıl, bugün nasıl? So think about that. Kendin için, yes. Değiştirip ekleyebilirsin. If you like, you can change it, you can add on it. Oops, he has lots of papers. Okay. So every day, today. Every day. Every day. Her gün. Every day means her gün. Relatives. Your uncle, your aunt. Yes. Hmm. Şimdi let's see. Can you make the write the first sentence for example? Go to work. Think about every day. I go to work every day. Uh huh. This is normal, every day. But today is Bayram. Are you going to work? No. I am not. Very good. I'm not going to work today because it's a special day. So the same. Think about relatives. Every day. Do you visit your relatives every day? No. I am not. Not I am not. I go. I don't go. Not M. Don't. Mm, I don't. Yes. I don't. Yes, I don't go. I, I. Okay. I go to work every day. Okay. Tamam. Um, Write it down. I go. Don't. What? Uh, which one are you writing? Today or ev uh, today? Today. I'm not going. I'm not. Because gitmiyorum. Gitmiyorum demek için ing ile söylemen lazım. 
I'm not going. Going, evet. I'm not going to work. Work. Peki, every day I go to work. Yes. Which one? Dessert. Dessert like baklava, kalbura bastı, kadayıf. Okay. All right. So, tell me, Ercan, number one. I go to... I go to work. Mm, I am not going to work. But today it's a different day. I'm not going. Yeah? Thank you so much. Emir? I don't visit. I don't visit relatives. Okay? I am visiting. I'm visiting. Today, yes, Abdullah. I don't eat um, dessert. Dessert. Every day. Mm -hmm. uh, but I am eating desserts. Dessert. To today. Yes. I don't eat with the whole. I don't eat with the whole family. Whole, everybody. With the whole family. But today, I'm eating, I'm eating with everybody, yeah? Today, I'm, I'm eating with the whole family. Okay, good job. So, are you happy with this? Okay, good. Um, if you are okay, could you please do the exercise B on 108, right here. The question, um, yes, not here. You need a notebook. Bir defter lazım sana. You have a notebook. Oraya yazmıyorsun. Why are you not writing there? Huh? Şimdi, we are doing this. It is the same. Now be careful. Is it every day or today? For example, complete the sentences with the verb in brackets. Use present simple or present continuous. Yaparım mı? Yapıyorum mu? So be careful with that. Do you usually work, walk to work? Oh no. I don't have my umbrella. Oh no. Yağmur. Mm -hmm. It's raining. It's raining. Bugün yağmur yağıyor. It's raining and I don't have my umbrella. Yeah? It's raining but I don't have my umbrella. Mm -hmm. My father and I My father and I Every week Her Every week. So, having me have me. Ama every week. Have. Yes, have. So, my father and I have. We have. Okay. Louise and Carl are on holiday. On holiday. On holiday means yes they are having a good fun time relaxing not working okay they're on holiday this week they they are skiing in switzerland they are skiing in switzerland this is not a regular activity right it is not regular activity it's not every day next one hi sam TV, football match? Are says no, homework. Are you watching? Are you watching the match? Sam says, no, I'm not watching. What are you doing? I'm not watching. I'm. Look. 
No. I'm no. Do. I do. I do or I'm doing? Doing now, yes? I'm doing. I'm doing the French homework. Okay? Number five. I always. Abdullah, what do you say? I always. Get up. Get up. At 7.30. But I never. Uh-huh. That's it. I never have breakfast. Never. Yes? Very good. My sister. Arjan, what do you say? My sister. Um, my sister. Uh, At the moment. Uh, now. Uh, uh, is traveling. Is traveling. Number seven, Emir. What time do you usually go to? Very good. What time do you usually? It's a regular activity, yes? What time do you usually? Next one. Look, that's my brother over there. Can you see him? He's wearing. He's wearing, yes. He's wearing a blue hat. Hello, Nick. Arjan, go for it. Hello, Nick. Uh, hello, Nick. Raf. Uh, yes. Raf. Where are you going? Yes. Where are you going? Where are you going? To the gym. To the gym. To the fitness salon, right? To the gym. I always. Go. I always go on Tuesdays. Okay, good job. Hopefully, this is going to help you guys. Now, going back to page 154. Page 154. 54. By the way, what does undercover mean? Undercover? Yes. Undercover boss. What does boss mean? Boss? Huh? Yes. No, no, no. Just one. No, no, no. Just fifty-four. <laughs> Just fifty-four. Yes. Undercover boss. Okay. Now we are going to listen and read. Okay. More about this TV show. What is this guy's name? What is his name? David. David Clark. David Clark, what is his job? He is an undercover boss. He is an undercover boss. So his real job is what? He is a boss. Huh? He owns hotel chain. Okay? He owns a hotel chain. So he's a boss. He's a businessman. But today, today is a different day. Is he a businessman today? Hmm? Is he a businessman today? Bugün patron mu? İş adamı mı bugün? Look at him. Look at him. He is not. He is a worker today. He is a worker. Worker? Yes, he is a worker today. Where? In one of his hotels. He is a worker. Okay, like a normal person, not a boss. So, in the book, sentences, do you see? What does number one says, Emir? The workers don't know that Andy is their boss. Hmm. The workers don't know. What is his real name? David, but his nickname, not fake name, Andy, undercover name, Andy. So is this true or false? 
Workers don't know. They don't know. So this is true. So number one, the workers don't know that Andy is their boss. This is true. They don't know. Okay. Number two. Abdullah, on Monday, David is cooking in the kitchen. Yes, he is working in the kitchen. Ajahn, number three. Uh, the people in the kitchen work a lot of hours. Uh, yes, how many hours? Uh, eight. 80. 80. 80. 80. 80 hours. 80 hours. That's a lot. Yes, next one, Emir. Is it true? Yes. It's true. Yes. Okay. Number five. Yes, Abdullah. On Wednesday, David is making breakfast. Wednesday, David is working in the restaurant. Here is he's serving breakfast, not making breakfast. Because serving, you give the food. Yes? But making, you make it. So he's serving. Yeah? He's not making, he's serving. Serve. So this is false. No, he is serving, not making. Okay? Number six, Ajahn. And the workers only have uh, 30, 30 uh, minutes uh, clean food. Uh, false. False. How many minutes do they have? A quarter, a quarter, uh, quarter means five, ten, fifteen minutes. They've got fifteen minutes to clean, not long, just fifteen minutes. Okay, back to you, Emir. David doesn't think cleaning is hard work. Mm -hmm. True, he doesn't think. Let me see, where does it say? David is cleaning the room. David is working very hard. He's very tired. So if he's very tired, he's very tired. So he thinks it is a difficult job. So this is false. Because he's tired. Okay. Number eight. Abdullah. At the end of the week, Andy says who really is. Who he really is. Hmm? Really means? Yes. Really. Gerçekten. Really. So, is it true? Look. I'm not Andy. I'm David Clark, your boss. At the end of the week, David says, I'm not Andy. Look. At the end of the week, David says, I'm not Andy. I'm David Clark, your boss. So? So? At the end of the week, Andy says who he is. I am David Clark. So true. Yes? Aja? Uh, all the workers get uh, more money. Uh, true. True. Good news, huh? <laughs> okay, so this time I want you to look closer to the highlighted words in the text. Look, some words are in yellow, okay, highlighted. What, the, what do they mean? Number one, what is it? Angry. What does angry mean? Yes, angry. Something makes you like you're, you're very angry, makes you you want to feel like you want to fight, yes? Makes you not very happy, yes. Angry, okay. Next one, serving, serve. Is it a verb, adjective? Because angry is an adjective. Adjective is a sıfat, kızgın, right? What about serve? Verb, servis etmek, 
Yes? It's a verb. Okay. Next one. Very hard. Hard is an adjective. What does it mean? Difficult. Difficult. The same as not easy. Okay. Next one. Um, surprised. Surprised? Surprised. Yes? Adjective. Again. Um, give. It's a verb. You give more money to the people who are working. Yes? So, important verbs here. Words here, sorry. You need to memorize and learn them. Okay? Angry. When do you feel angry? When do you feel angry? When and why? Like, I am angry in traffic. What about you? <laughs> when are you angry? At work? No? On the bus? Maybe. <laughs> what about you, Emir? Um, I'm hungry. Hungry or angry? Uh, angry. Uh, don't finish the race. Uh, the race. Oh, when you can't finish the race. I see. What about you? If you can't finish the race, when do you feel angry? Finished. finished. When your phone charge finishes, I see. Okay. When do you feel surprised? Hmm? The weather in Istanbul. I feel surprised. One moment, it's raining. Two minutes later, the rain is finished. <laughs> In Istanbul, yes? It's like that. Anyway, okay. Um, tell me something hard. Not easy. Mm -hmm. Work is hard, yes? His name is hard, yes. Abdullah is, is not easy to remember. Okay. Who serves you in a restaurant? Who? A waiter serves you in a restaurant. Okay. <laughs> Who is missing? There is one person missing here. Abdullah is missing. <laughs> Who is missing? Or we could say Eksik. He's come, yeah, okay. Right. Um, I was gonna tell you, okay, I want you to look at these words down here in your books. Do you see the glossary part? We have the word kitchen, oven. What does an oven mean? An oven where you bake a cake. Yes, it's an oven. Yes, and this one? Bedroom. This one? Clean. clean. Clean, it is a verb, to clean the house. Okay? And this one? Repair. Yes, to fix. Repair means to fix. Repair. Fix. Okay? You repair something, you fix it. <coughs> Think about the people in the kitchen. What was the problem? The kitchen, the people in the kitchen. Look, the workers are repairing things. Do you see? The workers are repairing things. Where is it? Okay, here. The workers are repairing things, but only in the rooms for the hotel inspection. So they are fixing it, they are repairing it. Tamir etmek. Okay, now um, 
We are going to talk about clothes now. Are you ready? Some vocabulary work is there. Clothes. Clothes. Now, clothes. Things you wear. For example, what? Clothes? Yes, clothes? Oh, no! <laughs> no! <laughs> cloud. It's cloud. Ah. Cloud. <laughs> but this one, clothes. Things you wear, okay? For example, that, what is that called? It's a? It's a cap. A? Cap, okay? What is this? Not jeans, no, not jeans. Not a t-shirt, yours is a t-shirt, mine is a blouse. <laughs> For ladies, okay? It's a? It's a blouse, okay? Yours is a? T-shirt. Abdullah has a shirt. Shirt. Yes? Jeans. It's always in plural. Okay? Jeans. Okay? I have? Shoes. What kind of shoes? Sports shoes. <laughs> yes, I always wear sports shoes. Sports shoes. This means? Trainers, okay? Trainers, sport shoes, they mean the same. Um, what else? What about that? This one. Pen. Not, oh, you could say pants, yes. But pant, it's in American English, pants means trousers. Trousers, pants, pantalon. In American English. American. This is British. But in British English, pants has a different meaning. It means underwear. Underwear? Each chamashir underwear. But pants is also the same. For UK, British English. Okay? So British English, pants means underwear. <laughs> It's funny, isn't it? <laughs> For example, you are British, okay? And I am American. He's British, English, and I'm American. I say, Abdullah, I like your pants. <laughs> <laughs> and everybody likes, starts laughing. Yes. So it's different. <laughs> anyway, now... Um, what do you need um, when your hands feel cold? You wear? Gloves. Gloves. Okay? This is something you need. Again, you put around your neck. Scarf. Scarf. Okay? Good? Something you wear when you feel cold? Coat. Coat. Yes. <laughs> nice. Coat. Something you wear in winter, not sports shoes. Boots. Okay, good. Now, in your book, please look at um, part three, exercise A. Look. Look at the sentences from undercover boss. Underline the clothes words. What do they mean? Here we have the word suit. Okay? A suit. What does it mean? A suit? A jacket and trousers. Yes. A suit is usually it goes with a jacket plus trousers. A suit. Yes? Um, what about a uniform? A uniform. Yes. School uniform. A police uniform. What does it mean? Uniforma. Uniform. Uniform. Okay. Next one. 
Um, okay, it's all there anyway. Now let's do exercise B. Can you do exercise B matching? Can you match the words with the pictures? Are you done? Let's do it. Picture one. What's picture one? Jeans. Yes, what color? Blue jeans. Blue jeans. Okay. Number two. A sweater. Sweater. Yes, for winter. A sweater. What color is it? Red. A red sweater. Next one, number three. A jacket. What color is it? Black, I think. A black jacket. Okay. Um, number four. A skirt. Yeah, what color is it? A black skirt. Okay. Number five. Trousers. And what color are they? Yellow. <laughs> Funny color. Yellow trousers. Number six. Shoes, actually, ladies' shoes, high heels. High heels. High heels for ladies, yeah. I'm going to write it down here. High heels. High heels. Okay. Next one. Number seven. A dress. Number eight. T shirt. Nine. Suit. A suit, yes. Number 10? Shirt. Shirt. shirt. What color is it? Blue. Blue, Blue shirt. Blue. Okay. Good job. <laughs>